Hey guys, this is Charles Jager with Metal. In this quick tutorial, we're gonna take a look at the Mobius Rotate effect that's a part of Mantra VR. This is a nice tutorial that shows you how to create a tiny planned effect in 360 that's also seamless. All right guys, inside of After Effects, I've got my 360 footage here. I'm gonna come up here to the Effects and Presets panel. I'm just gonna type in VR to toggle all of the Mantra VR effects. Then I'm gonna select the Mobius Rotate effect and drag it onto my 360 footage. Immediately, you're gonna see a really cool result, which is the Tiny Planet result. But what's unique about this is it's actually a seamless 360 tiny planet. So we have our tiny planet here in the center of our screen. But if you notice, it wraps around all these edges. And if we look at the Metal Global Preview, we can see we have our tiny planet. But if we look around the entire sphere, it is seamless. So this is pretty unique to get a tiny planet that is seamless using the Mantra VR Mobius Rotate effect. So let's go over here and look at the effect options. So we have the frame layout. We can select again between monoscopic or stereoscopic footage. Next we have a zoom in point and a zoom out point. So very similar to the Mobius transform effect with the zoom in and zoom out point. And you can see those two points represented here on our footage. I'll just zoom in here so we can see this a little closer. And you can see those are kind of the outer edges of our tiny planet. And I can actually click those and move them around. You can see it's gonna actually resize everything on our footage and we could keyframe this or do whatever we needed to with these points. I'm gonna go ahead and hit Control Z to undo that change. Next, we have an angle effect setting, and it's very important to realize what's happening with this particular effect. So we have these two different points, and what the Mobius Rotate effect is doing is it's rotating the entire equirectangular footage around these two points. So you see it's at default, it's at 90 degrees, and that's what's causing the tiny planet result. So if I actually go ahead and angle this back up to zero, you can see how it's rotating back down, and it's gonna rotate back to our normal footage. And I'll zoom out here so we can see these two points. So again, it's gonna rotate around these two points depending on the angle. So if I set this back to 90 degrees, it rotates everything back into that tiny plant effect. And I can continue to rotate this and you'll see how it's rotating. We can actually do the inverted look. If I go over here to 270 degrees, really the terminology I use for this look is kind of just the tunnel effect. But you can see over here, this is also seamless. If we look on the Metal Globe preview, I'll just go ahead and double click and we can look inside here. So you can see we see the sky. And if we turn back to the back side here, we just see the snow and we're kind of wrapped in this tunnel. I'm gonna go ahead and double click to exit the Metal Globe Preview and I'm gonna set this back to 90. And as I mentioned before, you can keyframe these two points anywhere on your footage. So this enables you to create some pretty unique animations. So one animation I might create here, I'm gonna go ahead and reset the effect. And again, it's at default at 90. So I might go ahead and I wanna do a transition from a tiny planet back to our normal footage. So I can create a keyframe here for the angle at 90 degrees at the very beginning. I'll just move down here in time about four seconds and set this back to zero. So now let's do a quick RAM preview of this and see the result. So you can see we have our tiny planet. It's almost as if we're lowering down to the planet's surface. Now we're transitioning back into the original footage. And you can also see that reflected here in the Metal Globe preview. And you can also see that reflected here in the POV perspective. It's definitely going to make creating a tiny planet effect on your footage drag and drop using the Mobius Rotate effect. All right, guys, this has been Charles Jager with Metal. Thanks for watching.